Hi guys, this is Nina from Wrestling With Disney and it's been a while since I've gotten to open up some Funko Pops on my channel. I do believe I have one right here as well as a few others around that I haven't gotten to show you that I got yet. So, let's start with the box I have here. This is a pop-up shop Funko. And the pop-up shop happens every Wednesday for my time. It's at 2 o'clock, I believe, Pacific time. It's 11 a.m. And they will release a limited or pop-up shop exclusive Funko. I used to be really into trying to get them, like, no matter what they were. But, you know, I've stopped doing that. So I'll only get them if it's something I really like. Because I'm starting to get, I'm starting to find the Funkos to be a little oversaturated. Like there's just a lot of Funkos. So, this is going to be a, we're starting to get clues of what it is on the box. Ah, oh, look. Wow. Okay. Oh, I love this color scheme. And this is the Peaches and Cream Mickey Mouse for Mickey's 90th birthday. This will be one that I'm going to open up out of the box to show you guys because obviously I have things in this color. Look at all that peaches and cream. He's going to be going right there taking Jan Brady's spot. So let's, uh -huh. let's open him up. So it's a Funko Shop Limited Edition. So I will open him gently out of the box. Gently out of the box. Ooh. Oh, I really like him. I just love the colors. I wasn't expecting to because they've done a few of these color variations. Um, so he is dirty. Some of it I've just wiped off. Um, but his eyes are dirty. So it's on this side. I'm going to try to zoom in so you can see it. So I don't like that at all. When you get something new in the box and it's dirty on the box. Like what is that? I don't know. I don't know what that is. But um, he's very small but very cute. And I'm very happy to have him. So this is kind of around here is where I plan on putting him. I can't really move Jan Brady because I have the Brady's. Oh, that's Marsha. I'm sorry. Because um, she's the oldest sister and that's her spot. You know, because beneath her is Jan and then Cindy. So I don't know. I'm going to have to move where this is or something. So he can have a better spot. Because the Brady's ain't moving. The next Funko that I got recently was a Target exclusive, and it is Baby and Johnny from Dirty Dancing. So we got this at Target. We didn't order online. The boxes weren't in the best condition, but I did say that this is one that I would be opening up, so I didn't really mind about that. They are the only two Funko Pops from this collection, which is fine. I think it would be awkward to make the other characters into Funkos. It's just not necessary. I love that Baby is in her pose of when she's kind of like dancing on her way to dance class. I think they did a really good job of making this Funko look like her. Since I don't know where I'm gonna be putting them yet, I'm not going to open them out of the box yet. Another Funko I got recently was from the Mickey Mouse 90 Years Collection. I thought this would be harder to find, but they all have been relatively easy to find. But this is the only one I really wanted of the main set, which is Mickey from The Brave Little Tailor. Growing up, this was one of my family's favorite shorts to watch. He's hard to see front on in the box. I do plan on unboxing him to display him, but I don't know where he's going yet. So I just don't like to unbox them until they have their place in the world. So there were a few other Mickeys, obviously, that you could get. 
you know, there is Firefighter Mickey, Conductor Mickey, Fantasia Mickey, but the one I really wanted was the Brave Little Tailor. If you have not seen that short, I really recommend seeing it. It's perfect Disney where it has fairy tale and romance and humor and it's very special. The next Funko I recently obtained was from the Funko Pop-Up Shop. Once again, that is the Wednesday shop that they do. And it was a Colonel Sanders Pop. So Funko is known for doing ad icons. This one I liked in particular because it reminds me of the Norm MacDonald rendition of Colonel Sanders from those commercials. So I thought he was super fun to get. Finger looking good. I have not opened this one out of the box because my husband likes this one too. He likes to keep his in the box. So we'll see what happens with this guy. The last Funko we got was actually my husband got it. He ordered this on Amazon as a pre-order because he was very excited about it. I did not know who it was. Um, I still don't really know. <laughs> it's the ACDC Angus Young Pop. So, I don't know if the box was always like this, hopefully, because that means I did it when I tried to get this down to show you. So since it is my husband's, I will not be taking him out of the box. I couldn't tell you whether or not this looks like Angus, my good buddy Angus, but maybe you can let me know in the comments below. So that was the one Funko that wasn't mine that I wanted to show you guys anyway. I hope you enjoyed this look into my Funko collection. My husband has been trying to help me display things. He's really more of the uh, decorator. He does great at like bachelor pad-esque decorating. He's really good at that. Um, <laughs> even though this isn't a bachelor pad, obviously <laughs> we're just into such nerdy things um, that it kind of like applies. But yeah, no, you don't walk into a bachelor pad and find the Brady Bunch Funkos. That's not how that works. So be sure to keep you posted on how I display these Funkos and maybe you'll start to find more behind me here in future videos. Please let me know if you're a Funko collector too. I'd love to know what you've been adding to your collection as well as if you've been doing those Wednesday Funko pop-up shop sales. I find they're fun if you get a fun Funko like the Peaches and Cream Mickey or the Colonel Sanders who I have now lost. So. Thanks for tuning in. I hope to keep you posted more on Funkos. I know I've been missing out lately, but I'm going to be showing more in the upcoming weeks. So if you like Funkos, please subscribe. And I will see you on the next video.